Hi everyone, uh, welcome to um, my channel. So I just want to share this simple fix that I have discovered when using or adding HDR videos into a, an a SDR Final Cut Pro projects. So you can try this fix using your Mac OS device. So I am currently using or I currently have a Mac OS Big Sur version 11.2.3. So I'm not really sure if uh, this option is available on older versions of Mac OS, but I hope that this will help. So first, let me show you the main issue here. Let me open my Final Cut Pro first. All right. All right. So in this folder, I have an HDR video folder, right? Then I have this five HDR videos. So let me show you that this is really an HDR video. So as you can see here, there's an HDR here, right? Let me add this um, five here. As you can see, um, these videos look like they are overexposed, right? But in here, um, in, the, in the view section, it is not. But when you try to add the one video there you will get this message adding hdr clip to sdr project so bright content will be clipped in this project to adjust the images brightness apply a color correction effect or apply the hdl tools effect to this clip so that is what you get so you need to fix that because it is like this one overexposed so you don't need to go through each of your videos like that um, in order to fix this so let's me let me just uh, tell you directly what you need to do in order to fix this so simply convert or encode your videos your HDR videos which you don't need to apply color settings anymore or go through the export thing using the quick time on each of your videos so um, here is the fix so just select all the HDR videos that you have so these are the HDV HDR videos that I have so I just put it in a single folder then um, select all and then right click using your Mac and you will see this um, encode selected video files there then you will get a pop-up there so you will get a pop-up this encode media so you will have an option on which setting or format would you like your videos to be encoded to so i'm always choosing this option when uh, exporting videos using final cut pro so that is h.264 then p there so you can actually choose higher um, settings there, but I will settle for this one. So uh, when you continue, there is a start uh, settings icon here, but the problem is percent completed, it's not showing there. But when you open your folder, you will have this um, converted files. There is a the file name will be dash one there you will see that one i think um the time will just take um less than a minute for each videos especially if they are not that big file so this is just a quick like um two to three minutes or five minutes yeah so it's currently 12 12 noon then i start at 12 12 11 i think yeah so you will see that and i only have five videos with uh less than 15 seconds each so you will see that one here um, that is that it's being converted but um it is not showing here in the completed encode media i don't know but yeah that still works i hope it will also work on your os right so i will just uh finish wait this and uh to have this all uh, converted or encoded 
so that I can show you that it will really work when I try to add it on the Final Cut Pro again, right? So let's just wait for the last one. So actually it only took like two minutes. So see, it's it only took two to three minutes, right? So once you're done, I, this wheel um, settings icon will be gone there. But yeah, that's all. It's all good. So everything is now converted. So it has dash one. All right. So dash one, dash one, dash one, dash one, dash one. There. These are the files that that are already encoded to um, SDR quality. So settings. So. Let me just try to have a look. See, there's no more HDR here. So let's see the 16 here. Okay, so this one is the HDR. So the one with the one with this file name, right? Okay, so let's go and open Final Cut Pro. Let's open a Final Cut Pro. Alright, so here it is. And let's try to add this okay so let's try to add this one okay let's just add it there all right so as you can see there's a really big difference here all right so these are the hdr ones and these are the already converted or encoded um hdr files to sdr so let's add one project if we can still get an error right perfect so there we go it's now working all good right so you can now have enjoy editing your videos that's the very simple fix that i have discovered to convert hdr videos and export it to an sdr project here in um, final cut pro so i hope you guys um like this video and also um, please subscribe and click on the bell icon for notifications of new uploads so from time to time i share a fix on technical fixes on video editing especially on youtube and final cut pro so um i hope you guys like that and also share this video to everyone so that they will know the fix so all right so thank you so much and bye